My name is Xavier Holt. I'm a senior applied AI scientist at Harrison AI. My name is Ben Hashi and I am head of applied AI at Harrison. I think the mission drives a lot of the culture at a moment, right? Because, yeah, I agree. Um, we're all motivated. We come to work and we really want to, to, to make these products succeed and build something um, that's going to be valuable to, mm. to the doctors and patients who are going to be using it. So I think that drives culture a lot. Ultimately, it's about exactly delivering these things that are then you know, shipped to hospitals and have yeah. a real benefit. For sure. Which is one of the really exciting things about working, yeah. working at Harrison. I mean, that's why we're we here, to, basically. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, the, yeah. And it's different, though. It is different mm. than other, other applied AI jobs, because True. a lot of other jobs doing the kinds of work that we do, um, uh, you'd be much more isolated from the impact of, of what, what, what the work is, is going to have. So mm. you'd be developing models still, but you wouldn't be focusing on something like clinical outcomes. You'd be focusing on something that's a much more abstract, um, yeah. a, a single, you know, some, some metric that, that you're using for, for optimizing your model. Mm. So I think that's one of the things that's, yeah, it helps us focus our work, um, but also part of the mission, I guess. Yeah. I think exactly. And just to add to that, you know, it, it's really sort of rewarding when it's not just this paper that you sort of submit or something. We, we get real world feedback. Um, basically, we, we hear that all the time from, you know, where it's deployed in hospitals and like lung nodules that are found that otherwise wouldn't be that had follow up scans and have like hugely impactful consequences in people's lives. So it's really, really beneficial for sure. There's a lot of hype around AI, so I think that that's definitely a topic in the industry that is, is I don't know if I'd say overinflated, but mm. it's, 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 often, it's often treated in, in, in a way that is, does not sort of appreciate the subtlety of actually um, applying um, machine learning to, to real world problems. So it's been really easy um, for people to go out and find funding to do something with machine learning in the in the last few years, and this is changing a bit now. Right? Mm -hmm. I think I think investors are getting smarter about about assessing, and it's not just whether you have uh, a few people with a degree from Stanford. You have to have you have to have a partner that's that's you know that's uh, that that is engaged, um, that is as as interested in the results as as you are you have to really know how to frame your problem in a way that it's going to be useful um, for the users yeah. as opposed to just something that's sort of intellectually compelling from a machine learning perspective um, and the data is really important and i think that's one of the things that uh, that we've done what dimitri and angus have done so yeah. well right is is build partnerships that give us a strategic advantage in areas where um, I mean, let's face it, we're not the only ones working on, exactly. on AI for healthcare and AI for radiology. There are a lot of other players out there who want to do the same kind of thing. But they don't necessarily have the relationships um, and they don't necessarily have the data set um, yeah. that allows them to, to do it the same scale and scope that, that we can do it. That's really, really compelling. Absolutely. It puts us in a really good competitive position. I think just to add to that, because I totally agree, is that, yeah, that, that sort of the whole model building side of stuff is perhaps sort of overinflated if, if you think about it in comparison to, as you're saying, the data, the data you have, you sort of can't, can't out train or sort of, yes. you know, out finesse, yeah. you know, having a yeah. better data set. And so that's super crucial.